welcome to our environmental lesson. The strand is social environment and our substrand is domestic animals. Ba ba black sheep, ba ba black sheep, have you any wool? Have you any wool? Yes sir, yes sir, three bags full. Ba ba black sheep, ba ba black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. Domestic animals. These are animals that are kept at home. These are animals that we see every day in our homes. These are animals that we see maybe when you're walking around the neighborhood. So these are the animals that we keep at home. So we are going to read together. Cow, sheep, cat, dog, camel, horse, rabbit. Let's read again. Cow, sheep, cat, dog, camel, horse, rabbit. So once we have known these domestic animals, there are some, of, there are some things that we get from these animals that we keep at home. A cow. A cow gives us milk and meat. That is what we get from a cow. Then we have a sheep. A sheep will give us meat. A cat. A cat, a cat, sorry, a cat provides our house with security. When we have a cat in the house, we cannot see rats running around. We have a dog. A dog provides our home with security too. When we have a dog in our home, we cannot see strange people getting inside our compound. So anytime someone who is new to our home comes in, the dog always alerts us by barking. Then we have a camel. A camel gives us meat and milk. We have a horse. A horse gives us meat. We have a rabbit. A rabbit also gives us meat. So these are some of the domestic animals that we have at home. And when we have these domestic animals, we are supposed to take care of them by giving them water. Some of them need grass. Some of them need food like a dog and a cat. They need food. And we are supposed to look after them and take care of them. Thank you and hope you have enjoyed our lesson.